Hello, my dear friends in Christ. How are you doing? God bless you for keeping faith. I'm happy you are always listening to me and to the Word of God that keeps us alive. Today, let's talk about the root, the way, the channel. You know, in Mark chapter 10, verse 35 onwards, Jesus had predicted his death and the sons of Zebedee with their mother only heard how glorious Jesus would become after the death. They forgot the route to the death. They forgot the death itself and they only perceived the greatness of the Lord. And so they came innocently. One wants to sit on the right, the other on the left. And Jesus is saying, hey, it is not mine to give. What is the key? Most of us are asking for so many things. We are asking for the glories. We are asking for the pleasures of life. We are asking. There's nothing wrong with it, my dear friends in Christ. But the truth is, how do we get there? And so the root is Jesus himself. When he says, you should pass through him. He is the way, he is the truth, and he is the life. If you can choose Jesus, I'm 100% sure you will get there. That is what I came to tell you today. And so, the truth of life is how do you want to get to where you want to get to? Good marriage, good relationships, good educational standards, good health, and all. The root is a key. And the root is Jesus. The root is where you will pass. And he is the way, he is the truth, and he is the life. Would you want to choose Jesus or you want to choose the glory ahead of time? Then you are making a mistake. Start following Jesus and you will get to where you want to get to. Most of us know where we want to go, but we don't know how to get there. And that is why we miss it. I don't think any of us is not aware of any city in this world. You may want to get to a particular city, but my dear, the truth is, how do you get there? The glory you are asking for, the victories you are asking for, the joys you are asking for, the happiness you are asking for, the root is Jesus. So when you go on your knees to pray, what do you ask for? The glory or the way? And Jesus is saying, it is not mine to give. Just follow me and you will get there. Today, my message is simple. Pray for Jesus. Pray that he stays in your heart. Pray that he follows you. Pray that you follow him. Pray that you go along. And I'm so sure, I believe, that God will take you to the destination where you hope for. God bless you. And I'll see you again another time. Shalom.